In today's episode of Imperion Galactic Survival, I grow some crops as all these plants die. Grenade some spiders. Multiple spiders together. Grenade launcher. And start selling my own brand of energy drink. 87. Sell for 2,600. Okay. Hello and welcome back. Imperion Galactic Survival Breaking Bad and uh, it is um, daylight, which is weird, but I think it's about to be dark. I don't know if this is a good omen or not, but anyway, welcome back to the Pentails. First off, I mean um, thank you so much guys for all the amazing comments and stuff um, I'm glad you're enjoying the series so far uh, a lot of you are pointing out sort of things that um, I, I should do and stuff. One of the ones that keeps coming up is Spanj, why don't you just create a, a fiber farm? <laughs> yeah! <laughs> I'm working on it! <laughs> you got to keep in mind that um, this, so far, I'm, I'm, about, I'm less than four hours into the game. Four hours of, of time in the game so far. Most of that has been running through the desert or on a hover bike in the desert. And then the moment I managed to actually get a base up and running and something that can actually produce grow plots, it gets destroyed and then I have to rebuild it so yes create a fiber farm of course why didn't I think of that but uh, it, it's not that simple um, now I've got eight grow plots so far I need a ninth which means I need a nutrient solution um, of which has just been created so I can now transfer one of these over here and I can create the final grow Plot for a group of nine. Now, on that note as well, I have eight. Uh, I have eight fibers there, and then in the blocks and devices, I think I've looted one fiber. I've just got out and farmed the the talent again for their plant fibers and fruits and vegetables and such. So as you can see, I mean everything apart from fruit is available on this planet, and the fruit is only available in berry form, which doesn't qualify enough to make emergency rations. What I'd really like, I'd really like emergency rations. There it is, but uh, you know, what we can do, what can you do, right? Anyway, I, the other thing I need is a um, health chamber, right? So, it's all very well having a base now, but I can't heal myself yet. So, let's see if we can build that as well. No, not one of those. Damn it, that's gonna build now. Come on, cancel, right. One of those, thank you. Do that. The penalty of a misclick, eh? Right. Uh, so we can make Dynasty Royales, Ratatouille's pizzas, tins of things, burgers, pies. You know, I'm just gonna queue up a bunch of stuff here. We'll make some coffee and the energy drinks here. 87 energy drinks in here. I plan on taking them to that Polaris uh, base and seeing if I could sell them there there is fruit available on this planet if you get lucky in the basket loot and stuff but yeah that's basically it so that's going to run and run 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 for a while oh, another thing that i do want to do to the base is add a number of solar panels so let's see if we can get like uh, eight so eight more solar panels to this thing okay so i think we're ready we've got nine grow plots we have a hydroponic lamp and we have uh nine plant fiber plants now in terms of food i'm not too worried about that growing food well the talent do that for me i can loot it yada 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 but yeah ideally you you want a, a food farm i suppose um so let's put the hydroponic lamp goes there and then this is going to tank the power which is why we need the solar panels in place this is going to breach as well so let's see we need to be somewhat quick here but there's our three by three one two three two three one, two, three. That should reseal it back up again. Yep, there we go. The O2 is now on. And obviously now if we do get a uh, hull breach in this place and it is subjected to the external temperatures, all these plants die. So I'm hoping the wall holds. <laughs> yeah, we will see. Um, there's a couple of solar panels coming through already. Good. And our medical chamber is ready as well. That there, that'll do. And... Yeah, as soon as those solar panels are ready, I'll go chuck them outside. Now, on another note, we do have now 114 grenades for the grenade launcher. Four repeating crossbow bolts. Meh. 
and 150 um, rounds of pulse rifle ammo, plus the 24 that's already in the in the rifle. Uh, now, I have bought some ammo from uh, some nitrocellulose. I should clarify it from Polaris once again, um, as we did before. So there is none of that left already, but there is some plant fibers now, so we can make a little bit more ammo for the ship and maybe a little bit more ammo there's 2250 in there so i had another bunch of 5.8 mil rounds then grab some out of the ammo box for me to use not many 700 that should do hopefully there's some meds as well um i'm gonna chuck that down there was normally where my ration packs go but I haven't got any, so we're going to have to rely on the fridge of the ship in order to carefully transport some food over for us um, so that we can do the Elder Tomb. Oh yes, we're doing the Elder Tomb today. Alright, so you are on. Ah, you've got something full in here. Humbug. Harvest controller. Ah yes, I did stop for some iron, didn't I? Is that going to fit in there? Hey, it does. I might transfer that iron into one of my portables, actually, and get that processing the iron into ingots for free. And that way, maybe I can turn the power off. So I do that, connect, and then chuck you in there, and then just, like, produce as much iron as you literally can. I'll be back for you later. Now, in terms of the rest of the base, um, the lights can go off, turn... The auto group again, then the constructors off. 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 I mean, it does mean that our, um, I'll leave the food processor running because I mean, this thing's got, what, how much power? Seven hours. Okay. Seven hours of power. And I suppose if I actually take the time to wait for the solar panels, I could increase that a bit more. Like five of them are ready. Let's go chuck these out. All right. So, five solar panels. These are quite chunky boys. There we go. Okay, so we've got a few more solar panels there. Hopefully, uh, they'll absorb some rays. Um, and hopefully that means the battery is going to charge. So far, absolutely nada. <laughs> well, okay, well, let's see what happens. Seven hours of power left. Anyway, uh, hopefully the solar panels will wake up and actually do something. In the meantime, ore is being processed. Food is being processed. Uh, speaking of which, let's chuck couple of bits of food in here we're gonna take um a couple of these because they heal so nicely they heal so nicely um i'll take some waters in case the very rare event that i get set on fire don't think that's gonna happen <laughs> let's take a couple of cans all right so we should be good now i have got my eva on let's swap that out for the armor boost all right at the Elder's Tomb. Elder's Tomb, you guys have been great on advising on the Elder's Tomb as well. Hopefully we can get some of the wood and stuff that you guys have been saying that you can get out of the Elder's Tomb. Um, and that might help solve our plant fiber shortages. We'll see. Next objectives as well after the Elder Tomb is Cobalt uh, up on the moons. Uh, we can go up into space in an unshielded craft. It is risky because drones will come and find you and get you. Um, but you can outrun them if you're quick, so. But yeah, if you go up in space in an unshielded craft and stop to maybe like harvest a wreck or inspect a, a POI or something like that, usually you then just get absolutely ganked by drones. Um, especially if you're the first up there. On a multiplayer server, hopefully, you know, I won't be the first and it'll be okay. But I don't know. It's very risky in an unshielded craft. Uh, we should be able to get over to the moon in this thing, though, because that's basically a non-stop trick uh, trip. Anyway, here we go. The Elder's Tomb. Lots of plant fiber around this as well. And aloe, by the look of it. So, we're going to need to pop this um, somewhere. Um, where we can have access to it the entire POI. Yeah, more of them. Oh, the spiders are coming.
that I was making some 115 mil. I'm gonna need that when I get back. Oh my god, they're everywhere. So many spiders. mil rounds should be sawing these things in half when they get hit by them but uh, there we go all right park the ship that's the fun noise isn't it it's rust us off all right so get this box before it despawns some ice and coffee nothing like a nice ice chap frappuccino whoa Do they just keep on coming or what? Wow. Apparently so. Alright, so let's see. If we retrieve. Oh, yeah, look at that. You're absolutely right. Inventory full. <laughs> of course. Yum. Let's take this in the harvest box. Look at that wood. Some actual wood, guys. Thank you very much, everybody, who suggested to take part the furniture of the Elder's Tomb. You're absolutely right. Sorry it took me so long to get around to here. It is the situation. We're here now. Look at that. There's plant fibers and aloe on the outside here as well. Should absolutely pick up. Yeah, this is, uh, I mean, we haven't even gone into the POA yet, and this is so worth it. <laughs> worth the trip. The Elder's Tomb. Clutch. I knew when we, we sort of flew over this place. The, the problem, the reason I didn't stop and pick anything up, A, I didn't know that uh, you could just brash it without taking a core out. Uh, and B, it needed guns. There's no way I could take this thing on with a survival tool that I had. Uh, I mean, you just saw the number of spiders that came out. Uh, well, I'm sure I could have probably defeated them in the survival tour. It would have taken me probably half an hour. <laughs> anyway, uh, there we go. So, aloe and plant fiber all around the outside. Pick all this up. Got to keep an eye on my oxygen now. And now, let's get into the POI and see what it's all about. Oopsie daisy. Oh dear. Appears to be a hole. Here we go. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to Spider Hell. It's going to be very much like the burial chamber. But I think there are even more secrets in here. Multiple spiders together. Grenade launcher. Problem is, they all die on the same spot. You can only tend to loot one of them. Scorpion. Didn't expect that. No, I think scorpion. 4,000 XP for one of those, though. Those things are nasty. That thing managed to get all of me. Could have been in trouble there. Not used to seeing Nick Scorpions outside of... 
abandoned type POIs, you know? Alright, straight away, two loot boxes. Very rare. Look at that. We got that pentaxid. 20,000 money. Ha <laughs> ha! Brilliant. No problems buying all the freaking nitrocellulose I need. Hopefully, won't need any more already. With the seven logs and 620 fibers, 75 wood planks, and that's before we even looted the rest of the place here. Take these off as well. I'll just go ahead and connect to the um, harvest controller over here. Gonna make looting a little bit easier and quicker. Alright, so do we drop down there or do we go down the stairs? I suspect they go both the same place, don't they? That looks like running straight headlong into trouble. Let's go the slow controlled route. Let's fight it down. Scorpions. This looks like where we would have dropped down into. You got that tomb vibe about it going on, huh? When dealing with spiders and general critters, high ground is absolutely key. Apparently, not high enough. Damn it. Reload. Come on. Forget how much ammo the pulse rifle just rips through. A twenty round, uh, twenty round magazine as well. It just, just, just reload city. <laughs> twenty or is it thirty? It might be thirty actually. Okay. I mean, we're going to end this. Um, this starter planet with all the friggin' sprouts, that's for sure. Huh? <laughs> so many of them. All right, so check the ceilings for hidden holes and passageways and such. It all looks okay to me. Down we go. There's a near identical sort of room on the other side. We'll go back up that way, I think, probably. Here we go. This will be... Let me reload. Sounds like a lot of trouble every which direction. Oh, from this one, this one seems fine. Don't tell me that's full already. <laughs> you real? For real, it's full. Oh my god. Okay, well, we've got the ammo box. So it's not totally the end of the world, but wow. Crazy. That's 1,600 filled up. And we've got another 1,000 in the ammo box here, so I'll fill that up. But yeah, this might take several trips. But yeah, I mean, definitely with the wood. <laughs> the wood. And they even these are 19 wood planks e each for the lights. Wow. Absolute wooden jackpot. 
I'm hearing a lot of spiders. I ain't seeing a lot of spiders right now. Oh! Oh, I heard footsteps. Oh, Frankie. They're everywhere. Oh my gosh. Coming down the chimney. <laughs> They're blocking the door. I can't get out. <laughs> oh my god that was rude that was so rude right <laughs> you're in the fridge everybody else in the ammo box how about okay There's a lot of trap doors here. Is that now full filled the ammo box up as well? <laughs> oh man. Okay, I gotta I gotta save the rest of my inventory for the rest of the POI. In terms of like fruits and vegetables and stuff. There's still a fair old bit to go, really. I mean you saw there's a whole downstairs bit now as well. Sorry, spiders. Come on, reload, reload, reload. Squeal. Oh yeah, I remember now. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. The downstairs bit. <laughs> yeah. Yep, 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 yep. Is there anything in here? Uh, there shouldn't be shouldn't be an empty room. This this there's something behind this. Like a trap door or something. Door of it. I see any any signs trap doorage but um, I'm sure there is one anyway <clears throat> we need to go down here unfortunately this is our next stop whoa that was close Multi kill. Blue, pute, blue on spiders. The worst. Got him. Everything's sort of beached up on bunched up on that corner there. Then the grenade launcher here is gonna be doing a fantastic job of taking him out.
waiting for that Imperiumpedia entry for the Wraith Queen to come up, you know? Sounds going weird. Reload, 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 reload. The Wraith Queen is alive. She's bunched up against the wall. There she goes. And there's the Wraith Worm. Wraith Worm? No, oh, I thought it was Wraith Queen. Oh, well. Wraith something or other. Anyway, here we are. This is where we came here. This room. Wait, is it this room? That's no, not this room. There used to be a middle room with four rare containers in it. Oh boy. Yeah, I don't really want to mess with that. That was a little bit above my pay grade, unfortunately. Have they taken it out? Oh no, here it is. Ha ha ha. SOB. Me? Yeah, okay. Um, I'm gonna have to come back, guys. I'm I'm too full of wood. I'm weighed down by how much wood I've got. All that wood is proving somewhat unwieldy. Too heavy, too much for the humbug to handle. I'm gonna need to go get rid of my wood. Sort it out. Is that enough? <laughs> Okay, back to the ship. Let's offload and let's get back here before it recharge, uh, regenerates. And uh, let's get the rest of that loot. And of course, all the rest of the wood stuff that uh, this thing comes with. I didn't come this way. That's the wrong way to go back. Go back the way we did come. Come this way? I think so. Okay. Look at that. I just noticed. Is a secret hole with more loot boxes. Okay, yeah, we definitely need to come back here. Dude. The loot is insane. Awesome. All right, let's offload. All right, we were back on base. Everything is offloaded. We have a fresh inventory again. Down we go. Oh, I'm gonna concentrate on the loot before we start harvesting boxes and all that, all that wood. That weighed a ton. Really moly did that weigh a ton. Okay. Hey everybody! Oh yeah, I came last time. I feel like I've a different come come a different way. It might be actually, I think I can. Yeah, well, we get to kill spiders. All right, there we go. Well, there was that hole actually that we wanted to investigate. Or was that up here? I think I've been through all this, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, secret hole, secret loophole. Yeah.
Shit. I knew when I was reloading, I was like, ah, he's gonna get me. <laughs> he did. Oh, hello. <laughs> and a laser pistol. I love the laser pistol. That's a good one as well. That's the LS38. That's amazing. This fucker, though. Oh, boy. We're going to mow some shit down. Okay. I'm going to swap you out for the crossbow right now because I know that you come with a full magazine. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay. So, uh, we've got some booty stuff. Ow! The piss did he come from? Jeez. Alright, well. Apparently things just respawn in your butt here. Your butt betrays you. Butt spawn. Um there'll be some oh, ice, more sprouts and veggies and general stuff like that. Okay, there we go. We're out of room in the fridge, but there's stuff in there that I can move about. But yeah, that's not bad for a secret loot hole. More butt spawners. So what's this thing? Can I get in here? Oh yeah, this drops me down to where I need to go. Swish. That's very swish. Right, again, we're kind of ignoring the uh, the furniture here so we can try and get that loot. Reasonably clear down here now. Ready. He says. Clearly spiders. Either respawn or move from the other side. It's the last reload. Four more bullets. The muzzle flare on this is nuts, man. I can't see anything. All control bursts. That sounded like a sh boot on, yep. No, you did not shoot that green shit at me. Here we go. There's a spooder in here. Come on out. Stop using the loot as a freaking shield. All right, there we go. Whoa. There we go. Ah. A pulse laser, reinforced medium armor, discosium ingots, the fuel, gold, 13,000 credits, a basic factory construction kit, and 18 fusion cells, a T2 multi tool decontamination kit, shotgun upgrade, more fuel, and a radiation shielding armor boost. Holy hell. <laughs> what is this POI? It's awesome. I mean, it's spider hell, right? You know, if you've got some chronic arachnophobia going on, it Fs you hard. But uh, I don't think there's anything else in here. I think if you clear all these spiders out, that's it. It's just congratulations, you've cleared a bunch of spiders out. I don't believe there's actually any loot boxes down there. But I could be wrong. And if I am, please do let me know in the comments down below. Okay. Um, so we've got... Boots on spider there. Um, we got some full ship of inventory now. Let's get some wood. Get out of here before more of them come. All right. Oh, hello. Mm. 
Damn it. Not my fault the ship keeps collapsing. Okay. Alright, we're out. We're out, we're out, we're out. So, got all those rooms back there that have wood furniture in them. Let me just check this hole real quick. Interesting. Another loot box. Ah, a rocket launcher. More Neo. Another shotgun upgrade kit. Trauma kits. Radiation, immunity, and foods and stuff. Nice. Secret hole. And this, I think, drops you on top of one of the nests. Yeah. The balls. It drops you on the balls. Um, which I prefer not to. I don't want to be dropped on the balls, thank you. Just loops around. Alright, cool. Now, I think that's it. Possibly, probably not. You guys probably know a thousand other loot boxes in this place, but I'll let you guys have fun in the comments section with that one. I'm pointing out all my stakes. Um, okay. So, uh, we're about to fix the eight. Let's top that up. Definitely still more bugs in here because I can freaking hear them, right? Is that my donation? Oh. Hmm. Swish. Here, ice. There we go. Look at that, 34,000 credits. That's pretty tidy. I'll give it that. I suppose that, that's the point. Where did, where did these um, trap doors take me? Where are they? Where did they go? Is that into where we've been before? Oh, yeah. Oh, that drops me into hell. <laughs> There's the loot room that we were in. This is a good opportunity to just double check my theory about there being no other loot around here and them just being balls of doom and lots of spiders. Yeah, pretty much. It's a lot of XP, in fairness. So, you know, if you're looking to level up, this is the place to come. Spiders on balls. Balls in spiders. Everything's just wrong. There we go. We really need to connect to this. It's full. Okay, so let's connect to this. Yeah, so much wood. <laughs> it's amazing. <laughs> the logs you get just from from the freaking the lights is nuts okie dokie then well, I think that's it pretty much um, though you can go digging through the walls I suppose in search of hidden rooms and secret places forbidden places but yeah, I don't think you're going to find much more else than what I've already discovered. All right, let's get back to base then. Let's start putting this wood to work. First stop there, uh, the Polaris base. To turn in my 36,000 there and one coin. Now, I don't think there's anything we need from these guys in the immediate. Like, we've got EVA, we've got radiation, we've got... Oxygen. We don't have an installation, but we don't really need to have a need for it right now. We've got refined pentaxid now as well. Cobalt may be needed, and Neo. So let's see. What is 107 cobalt? I mean, we can go to, up to the moon and buy this. 4,900. Neo. Well, uh, what is? How much Neo did we need for the diggity? None. It's all just cobalt. 161 cobalt, which I might already have anyway. Um. Screw it. I'm going to buy it anyway. <laughs> I'm going to buy it anyway. Because I can. <laughs> Why not? Yeah, hey, pull it anyway, aren't you? Yeah, yeah, whatever. And you do your pistols and stuff like that, don't you? Okay. Small bridges. Um, Yeah, everything else we kind of got. So, not worried. Now, the minigun. So, there's 8.3 millimeter minigun rounds here. Can I unlock the minigun yet? Assault rifle, assault rifle, minigun, yes I can. Okay, so I can build that. Uh, but it might save you some of the plant fiber. Not that that's now really an issue. So we may as well just uh, go and make it, huh? Thank you very much, traders. See you later, bye. Oh, wait. Um, 
there was something I wanted to do, and that was sell as much of that stuff as I could. Bertram's, here is some energy drinks. Um, 87. Sell for 2,600. Okay, I'm gonna a bit of my money back. Big deal. Yeah, I picked up so much freaking stimulant or whatever it is from the talent. May as well sell it, right? All right, back at the base, and no one is surprised that I am under attack. So, uh, no little flaggies on the map yet. I haven't managed to get myself topped up on ammo yet either. It's just literally just unloaded the ship and it's off. Okay, so we need to find and murder the shaman. Okay, so not sending T-Rexes this time. It just looks like warriors. Works for me. So generally, the way I find... The um, best way to find these guys is to get to a point where the... The base is about that far on the minimap, and then fly in a circle. And I don't know if you noticed or not, but the green flag appeared on the minimap ever so quickly, and then disappeared again. And there didn't appear to be a talent shaman around here or anything. Certainly wouldn't be this far out. So they seem to have. Um, they, see, they seem to be like red herrings, basically. You think, oh, it's there. No, it's not. So yeah. Or a circle around the base. This far out. And there we go, there's two of them right there. Now it seems to vary. Two, three, four. All right, five. But once you've done a full circle, um, and there's none left that you can find, go back to base. If things continue to teleport, then you've missed one. If they don't, it's over. There's no indication or no alert that it's over. You just kind of have to guess. That was four. I'm guessing that's it, but you can see there another little flag popped up there, but there's no shaman here. We're almost full circle now. That's it. I think we got them all. But yeah, slight pain in the ass over Xerox patrols. I suppose you could just let the base attack run when they're just sending warriors in. The sentry guns and stuff are, are more than a match for them. But 29 minutes of that going on and just drive me mad. So I'd rather just fly the ship around a little bit and deal with it. You know? Um, but I suppose later on in game, once the resources aren't a problem and you've got more ammo than you know what to do with, just let them run. You don't mind the noise, I suppose. All right, there we go. Attack dealt with, the plant fibers are, gr are growing, I, ac I actually turned the lights off, including the grow light, I, you know, dirt brain, um, so <laughs> they haven't grown at all, um, it's back on now, hopefully they'll grow up big and strong and we'll have plant fiber now that I've just, um, no, not that, not that, that, what I want, uh, now that I've managed to harvest a bunch of trees and stuff like that, uh, I've got the... The small here, I'm working on minigun rounds. And it's also worked on a bunch more of the 7.62s as well. So that's good. Grenades, the grenade launcher is about half health because that thing wears out so quickly. But mind you, so is the pulse rifle. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to let these guys run for a bit. Now then, we need to up our resource acquisition. The uh, the humbugger here is good, but we need the old diggity. So we can see what we can do about this. Carbon substrate, 1,600. Let's have a little look-see. Um, yeah, got a little problem here because I can't put that anywhere. <laughs> the base is full. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, we've got a bit of resources just sat out there at the moment, but that's fine. We're about to chuck something in the factory. The so 1,600 carbon substrate. Well, there isn't enough carbon substrate. So, we can go out and mine some, or we could make some from all the fibers and stone that we have. I'd rather go out and mine some. Let's see what else we got. Iron 826, copper 690, and silicon 460. Well, okay. Iron, not enough. Copper, basically out. 
and silicon basically out. Crap. All right. Yeah, um, <laughs> suddenly looking, looking at all possible titanium 25 and cobalt. The 25 titanium, I'll do, and the cobalt, right? So there's that and 107 cobalt. The rest can come from things like cobalt alloy. Pick half of this and see how much that does. 25, okay. I don't want to use all the cobalt up because then that obviously limits my construction potential. So we're going to need to go and get cobalt. We're going to need to go and get iron, copper. Well, actually, let me check the constructor outside because that was doing iron, wasn't it? 920 ingots of, of iron there. That's pretty good. There we go. So we got the iron. We'll put that in there. Save a bit of space as well by turning this very heavy pentaxid. Uh, into refined. That will free up a bit of space as well. Okay, carbon, silicon, and copper mining. Right, copper mining. Carbon mining. And silicon mining is a little bit different because there's no silicon deposits left, or rather, there's one, but I'm, I'm keeping that around for anybody who drops in and needs that initial burst of silicon. My only other real option here on the planet's surface, at least is to skim surface rocks, um, which doesn't take very long here in an SV, especially considering how dense they are. But yeah, um, definitely a little bit slower than mining in a, a deposit, that's for sure. Still, um, I'll get some this way just to tie me over, I think, and, and get the diggity in, of course. And then I think what we're going to do next episode is head up into space and probably the moon, one of the moons and see if we can get some cobalt and pentaxid up there and you know whatever else we find up there we'll take a look but uh yeah that is going to be all for today ladies and gentlemen i do hope you've enjoyed this episode thank you very much as always for all the wonderful tips advice and feedback keep it coming and um yeah hopefully i'll see you next time until then take care bye bye